Hi, I'm Jared Drake, and I'm going to talk to you about how to make 3D movies. What you need to make your own homemade 3D movie is you need two cameras. Um, basically, what you do is you shoot the scene, the story, the exact same way you would shoot it with one camera, except now you have two cameras rolling, and they should be, you set them side by side. You want to keep them about uh, you know, three to eight inches to a foot apart from one another. So at the end of production, you've shot the entire film from two different angles, from two different cameras, essentially the same angle except they're offset, just a tad. You import that footage into whatever um, system you're using to edit. And what you do is you take both the, you take both the footage, one of them you put a blue overlay onto it, and depending on what software you're using to edit, there's a number of ways to do that. And the other one, you put a red overlay onto it. Then you take um, both those images, you throw them into the timeline, over, overlay them on, put them on top of one, one another so they, they have an overlay. And what you should be seeing on your screen at that time is that weird 3D look that, that, that you see when you don't have the glasses on. And essentially, you know, it's the two layers, that's where you see your offset. The more your offset is, the greater it is, the more of a 3D effect you're going to have. And the more blurry your image is going to look at this point. So then you edit the entire film with these images. You, you have a full timeline of the overlapped blue, the overlapped red. You export it to whatever you want to export to, um, you know, QuickTime, Windows Media, whatever. and. Uh, there you go. You have your 3D file on your desktop or on your hard drive exported and you should be able to play it back and put on 3D glasses and see 3D.